So Snell Wagon Bank, um, one of the big things I tell everyone out here, from tip to tail, you're looking at 20 almost miles of bank. Fish are all over the bank. Understand the winds, understand the currents, and you'll find the fish. We have a wall that we caught this morning that is almost 300 feet tall. Um, and on that section of wall, there's gonna be different layers of fish. And as the currents will push on the wall, it'll push the sand eels off the bottom, hence we'll, the herring and the mackerel and the whiting will all chew on those fish, which will attract in the bigger fish. And ultimately, the whales are there eating the same thing. So it's, it's no surprises where the fish are. You gotta study where the wind is in the current. Once you figure that out, you'll have a good idea where the fish are gonna be. You know, at the beginning of the season, we start out, we, the haddock bite is the strong bite. Um, it's a haddock slash, maybe occasional offshore for poor beagle, but then that'll transition into the striper, then that will transition to bluefish, and then into the tuna season, and tuna and shark. Um, so we progress with the fish as they're moving through. But the last couple of years, it's been super unique where all the species are here the whole time. The tuna are coming early and early every year. The haddock is staying here all year long, which is amazing. So it's, it's definitely changing. So we're evolving with it, hence why we're in a center console now, not in a down east. And that way we can adapt with the fishery. We're catching a little bit of everything out here. We actually don't know what's gonna happen on each rod. Any given time, we could have things from halibut all the way to tuna and shark. So the Southport, um, we find that it's, it's built up in Maine, very well manufactured. Literally, we've had this um, Southport all the way five feet off the beach to 40 miles offshore this year. Very versatile, the draft isn't too much, so we can really get in tight. I know the striper that right now are, are swimming on six to eight feet of water on the rocks, and we can really get in tight with that. Unlike the down east boat where you're drafting six feet, we really can't do that. And that opens up even more charters for us. Fishery's good, fish are here. We don't have great big draggers on there ruining it for us. It's about very well protected. So the opportunity, and you can catch just about anything out there. You have a whale show, we have a turtle show, we have, we have just about everything out here. Some people, they're surprised at what we actually have out here, but it's truly amazing.